Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play More Final Fantasy for the After Years as we continue on to probably very definite final dungeon. How the okay, there we go. I was going to say, how the hell do I get out of here? Alright, so this is my party. I know you guys, some of you guys said, uh, with that word in the party, what the fuck? Uh, that you don't really need a white mage, but as you can see, he's only level 30, and he's not doing great in the HP department right now, so I need the backup. Okay, so is this, uh, um, robot naming way? Or, like, some kind of holographic apparition, or so many remedies do I have? I'm fine. I don't know. Okay. So we have a not working elevator. Okay. Yeah, I'm really disappointed that they didn't find... This looks really gloomy. This looks like, like, World 6 and Super Mario Brothers. Like, the original. Like, everything was gray. This is what this looks like to me. But I'm really disappointed that they didn't find some use for, uh, Fat Chocobo in here. Because, I mean, in DS, he doesn't have... Um, a purpose either. Well, in game, he's more just like bonus feature um, stuff. But they still, you know, he's still in like two or three spots. And uh, I like how the fat chocobo on. Um, yeah, you suck your ass. On uh, the mothership is actually a robot, which I think was really cute. I thought that was awesome. Alright, so I have no idea where the hell I'm going, so... You guys are just gonna have to bear with me. No, you just do that, Edward, because you're freaking useless at att attacking right now, because your stats suck! Oh, it's gonna be one of these douchebags, huh? Fine! And my glasses are absolutely filthy. I haven't washed them, cleaned them off since I was sticking them up. Okay, I apologize uh, terribly for that, guys. I was going to say, I'm going to put on auto battle for a second while I had my glasses in my hand and cleaning them. And I hit the wrong button, which changes the output on my PSP, so it went back to my PSP instead of the TV screen. So, apologize for that really, really awkward edit there. That's what I get. But in all fairness, it's not like I could see very well before I took my damn glasses off and then couldn't see what I was doing. I almost had the button, I was off by about an inch or so. Whoops. Okay. So we have a ladder down here, but I don't know what's on the other end here. So we must explore. Okay, there's another one right there, alright. I have no idea where the hell I'm supposed to go. I don't know, I don't know if there's like caves here and I just find one or something. I have absolutely no freaking clue. Apparently I'm doing just fine on auto battle over here, so uh, Fluttershy needs some healing. And so does Edward, but... My own damn fault for not paying attention. Okay, so it's a lot of the same stuff so far. Edge is a freaking beast right now, I swear. He is just so damn awesome. And I, one thing I noticed, I realized right before I popped this in, to start recording, like I'm, god damn it! Now I gotta bring him back to life. Oh yeah, it's like you, you couldn't kill Edge and leave Edward alive, so I can at least get some EXP for the poor bastard. Nope. Oh, you son of a bitch! You sir are a butt munch. Fine. Eat some of this. I'm gonna spew some acid slash virus slash whatever the hell this is stuff supposed to be. Okay, so I guess next time, uh, maybe I'll try like casting stop on them or something. All right, so let's go down. Let's explore this moon thingy. I don't... No, no. Alright. Hold on. Hold on. No, I didn't mean to put it on auto battle. Dang it. 
I want to hit the snake and triangle button because give me Fluttershy's turn. Does she have stop? Does she have stop? She does not have stop. Wait, stop is black magic, isn't it? Or maybe not. I have, yeah, there we go. All right, so let's see which one of them works. All right, fine. There we go. I'm gonna say, I thought she friggin' had stop. Get something on this guy. Rito, what are you doing, sweetie? She's running around like a nutcase. Eh, can I steal anything from me, you jerk off? All right, there we go. All right. Callum, can I get your turn, please? Or Fluttershy, you'll do too. Except you got frigging nothing. Okay, now she found her toy mice and she's playing with that. Okay. I haven't played with it in a while. So if you hear any random thumping in the background, that is her. Oh my god, Fluttershy, you suck right now. Oh god, you suck so hard. I don't like you to suck, but... I know she doesn't have the best stats compared to, like, Porm and Rosa, but like I said, character development trumps usefulness in battle. That is my excuse. That's the same reason why I didn't use Pelham in the original game, and why, partly why I'm using him now. He's redeemed himself. Somewhat. Sort of. Still a jerk, but at least he's more of an understandable jerk. How much HP do these things have? Holy cow! Alright, so that'd be a dead end. That would be a dead end. Okay. Yeah, this is gonna be an interesting uh, end to this. Oh, cave right there. Okay. Definitely going there. At least we have something here. Actually, hold on. I still have them in my inventory, don't I? Where the hell are they? Can I even actually this what I have it? Oh, you can't even use sight here. What the hell? That is not cool. Is this like the only place I can go? Maybe? I'm gonna check out that of uh, that upper side. I wanna be sure. Wanna be sure I'm not like missing anything. But I mean if that's the only way to go, what's with this convoluted path here? Like, why not say, here's the damn moon thing, whatever, just get your ass in there. Okay, so I guess that is the only way to go. Okay, fine. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna, no. Um, do that. And I can't even sneak through there. Balls. Alright, so we'll go all the way around. Well, everyone's gaining a little bit of HP here. Thankfully, nothing but the stupid coral has killed him yet. Oh, hello, mothership. It seems like we never left you. Okay, so... I'm gonna heal up really quick here. I can't even use a tent out here! And I can't... Game? Is that not considered an overworld or something, then? That is balls to the walls. Oh god, is this the same subterrain? Are you serious? Please don't, please no. Please god no. Even though it's not the same moon, you dolts. It's not. But whatever. Have it your way. Put Fluttershy on healing duty. That's why I brought her in the first place. Oh, goody. Goody, goody gumdrops. Yeah, and uh, judging by what some of you said about uh, having certain party members in certain places, this place is freaking massive. Holy cow. I would like to also point out. Oh, that's gonna kill Edward. 
Holy shit, that hurt. Um. That. We have already exceeded the length of the original game. And we're just now in the final dungeon. Just now. Yeah. And judging by the enormity of this place from what you guys have told me, this is going to take a long ass time. I mean, I've, I've already been LPing the After Years for six months. It has been a, almost six months since I started. I started in January. And of course, Edward doesn't have his stupid dragon slaying equipment. Oh no. Whoops. We gotta have it on keep. So we're gonna have to remedy that. There we go. Give me my damn dragon slaying harp. I do know what's in this game, though. I have been spoiled on that. That I, that I will be getting it eventually. And she finally learned her level 2 black magic spells. Oh, another thing, too. Um, while I haven't compared it directly, um, someone did mention that uh, Fluttershy does learn her spells very, very slowly. Um, which is fair enough. But that she also levels decent, you know, pretty quickly. Now, how quickly, I don't know. I have not compared uh, or looked up uh, her leveling stats in comparison to anybody's. And I haven't looked up forms or anything like that. But I do know Rosa, oh god help us, she levels so slow. Like when I was um, practicing and testing stuff for Kane's Challenge Dungeon. Oh, I need to fix that. Um, like seriously, she was taking like... 50, like a full 50% more experience to level than Kane did at the same levels. It's like, oh my god. It was just awful. I don't even know if she is max level or not. She may not be. I'll have to look that up. So I know Kane is, but I may have, I, I don't think I intentionally uh, grinded her to max. But through my random ass testing, she might be max level. I don't know. No, I hate when they do that. What level is Edward now? I'm going to 33. Mm. Is that cottage always? Was that treasure chest always there? Or am I just misremembering stuff? I think I want to go through this. Do I want to go through that secret passage first or do I not? I can't remember. I think after I played this game the first time and went through here like... How many times did I go through here? I don't know, but I've played DS for three times already. And you think I should have this play damn place memorized, but I don't. Probably because it's been a long time. So, not the curse ring. I already... That's like number six curse ring I have. Uh, which, which, speaking of... Oh, they're not, they're not gonna make... Me, of course... I don't know if I mentioned it at the beginning of the episode. Uh, I know partway through it, I was at least in mid-sentence to try to mention it, but when I assembled my team, I did notice to myself that I don't have a, no, none of these characters can equip shields. <laughs> but anyway, um, if anyone knows any good equipment combinations to use with the curse ring, I will consider using it. I mean, I have a bunch. So if there's like a particular... Um, oh, this is just a secret passage that just wraps around the one that's stupid. But I mean, if there's any, whether, whether or not there are any, um, com like specific combinations, oh god, this is gonna hurt, um, that are good with the curse ring, whether or not I have the pieces of equipment yet, um, let me know, because, I mean, if, if there's situations or equipment setups that will make them really useful, then, hey, I'm all for it. No, you're magic dumbass. Because I know there definitely is a use for them in the, the super bosses in DS if you have the right equipment on them, so. Oh god, this is going to be one hell of I don't even know what the hell the save points are either. I don't know if they've added any. Which means I have to do either multiple episodes at once or back out and, and come back. Crap. 
Oh, that is gonna suck something fierce. I just went right, right? I just came from that direction, I think. Okay, I either need to take Fluttershy off of healing, or I need to osmos some people, because she's running out of MP! And Pelham is too. Uh, let's use his. Ow! And, no, go back up. Do something for that poor guy. Yeah, I'm not even caring at the moon, but the... Pelham, you jerk off! Go faster! Is this, like, just a really slow spell or something? Oh, fine! Fine, you fart knocker! Have it your way! Ah, oh, damn it, I... Damn cur keep thing, I keep them... Ugh. I mean, I mean, it, it could come in handy, but there are times like that when, when you have to deviate from the course and you forget to fix it. Alrighty, yeah, stupid thing, use poison gas on me. And... Like, poison, like, freaking anybody, everybody. Now, do I have... Let me try that. Actually, will that cover, um, poison? Because, I mean, someone mentioned to buy more antidotes, and I'm regretting not doing that. Well, more than I already had, so. Why does a pile of broken glass give you a bad feeling, Obi-Wan Kenobi? Edge, why did you become such a chicken? Like, like... Is, is this supposed to be like a broken crystal or something? Is that what they're implying that to be? You know, I'm gonna... No, I'm not- I'm gonna wait until I get into a random battle, because you know, as soon as I freaking heal myself, it's going to give me a random battle. Okay, so our missile staff is a bust, but I could have sworn there was something. Oh, I need to fix my inventory, goddammit. I could have sworn there was something, or was that in the original game, that it casts Isuna? When, um... She shouldn't have done that, because that takes her, um... Where is my Ruin Armlet? I could have sw sworn there was something that, um, cast Asuna. But it am I just confusing that with the original game, or like a piece of equipment that their, their, the status changed? I don't know. You know what? Screw this. I'm, I'm, I'm keeping this back row. Because then I'm going to forget the commands I put in, and it's going to screw me over in the end. Might as well do it my way. Okay, now I think I've got everyone settled back on the keep. Oh my god, this is just gonna be so... Oh my god, this is gonna be... Epically bad, is what it's gonna be. Explosion. Actually, let me look now. Can I freaking use teleport? Oh my god, thank you! No, no, Edward, you can you can take a bunch of the shitty potions. There we go. Ooh, shiny crystal. What smell? Amber, what what the hell are you talking about? Like like what is? I have no idea what is going on here. I have... What the fuck? Um... Okay! As if I can friggin' remember how to do this damn fight! Okay! No, 
uh, crappy. That, that's what makes him cast Reflector some bullshit, right? Yeah. Oh, God damn it. Damn, 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 damn. But that's okay. I can still attack his puny little body. We'll find some other way around it. Ah, oh, crap. Palm doesn't have quick, does he? Oh, now he just paralyzed the fucker so I can't even look. Game. You suck right now. Can I use that instead? Why don't I use that instead? I mean, yeah, it's got a little bit of charge time, but... Might as well. Okay, do you have... I don't think you have reflect. No, you don't. Um... So I'm not gonna do anything good. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try. I don't know. I, I'm tempted. No, what the freaking hell am I doing? Is a spider suck affected by reflect? No, it is not. Alright, good to know. Good to know. I never even thought about that before. But that is pretty darn cool that it bypasses reflect. That is pretty sweet. That is something to know for later. So if anyone's wondering, because I never freaking thought of that, apparently it is. Okay. Cool beans! Uh, what do I want to do? You, you just shoot him. Shoot him. Can I get a haste marsh, please? And I just totally should... Haste me, damn it! Um, should... No, 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 wrong thing. I wanted haste to go on me. I'm not waging Edge's attack to heal. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not. Not gonna happen. Okay, you can have an X potion because you're special. Alright! Wait a second. I thought X potions only heal a thousand! What the heck? Okay then! Please what? What do you want? I don't know. Can I have lost your arm? Not get me anywhere. Please? Yeah, I always most like something. Like one of the Amazons, I think, and I got whole two MP out of it. I'm like, God, Jesus Christ. Like at that point I'd rather have a zero. It's like it's like at that at that point the game was just trying to troll me. And Excuse me if you can hear me adjusting my headset a little bit. I definitely, I need a new one because the, the ear fuzzy things that, you know, oh, awesome, thank you. Well, actually, no, there's a save point right freaking here, but at least I, I got something to work. But, um, like the little fuzzy things that, like, protect your ears from getting hurt by the, um, what am I doing? Um, the hardness of the headset, those are, like, falling apart. Like the cover thingies. I don't know if there's an official name for them. I really don't know, and I don't really care at the moment. I know I say that a lot. That's like one of my new catchphrases. Don't really care! You know what? Do that. Actually, now he's not paralyzed anymore. Of course, the asshole's got reflect on. Can I get a friggin' haste march? Please! We got a couple one in random battles. Here, you here, poor little Edward. Do you have Quake? No, you do not! You suck, but you can kick the crap out of that thing. Which is totally gonna jiggle around and be all funny looking. I'm surprised I haven't, like, self-destructed yet. Thank you! Now watch this thing be, like, three hits being away from being dead. Actually, that'll solve my issue of... Yes, that issue of, um, probably should've done that before, because now the main body is, um, on the front row. So, and of course I'm on a shitty moon here, so that's really not helping. What still lives? What are you talking about? Yes. What did I tell you, like three turns left? Little slow on the uptake there, Edward. I 
I can only refer to assume he's referring to Mary Sue, but this just seems like an awkward time to bring this up. Yeah, well, we totally had your parents and Rubicante show up, so... I, I suppose anything is possible at this point. And, 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 and we resurrected the Dark Elf, so... What else, you know? Sure about that? Okay, and we automatically rest. Did that use one of my tents? I did not ask... For, allow that. What? Um, okay. <laughs> you know, I know people told me, like, certain cutscenes occur at certain points, but I did not write down at this moment where and when they occurred and who to have, because I didn't think I would get to any of those points in this episode to begin with. And I was totally going to end the episode on that save point, but... I guess we have to do a little cutscene. Okay, fine. Yeah, he's still kind of fucking brain dead. But Cedar isn't even in the party right now. Alright, I'm, I'm guessing it's... If I had to take a gander here, and I don't have enough information to tell if I'm right or wrong, I kind of guess this is like the Chrono Trigger Syndrome, where you have a limited number of party members that you could actively use, but for storyline purposes, everybody is all together, because everybody knows what's been going on the entire time, and things like that, if you know what I mean. So I'm guessing it's something like that. But why the hell Ursula doesn't know this if Cedor and Cecil are with them? I have no idea. But then again, there's 22 friggin' people in the party, so who the hell knows? Who the hell knows? I'm getting way off track here. Okay, if you say so. He totally tried to threaten you and totally tried to kill Kane, but okay. What do you mean you've changed? Do people know each other before? And I'm guessing it's possible. I mean, somebody in frickin' Kaipo knew the, who the hell Cedar was, so... I don't know, maybe his parents... Maybe they do do a little traveling and get around. Well, cuz... Well, Ursula, to be fair, he does! And for those reasons you're stating right there! <laughs> that is a heavy burden to bear! This is why I actually like and understand his character, because that is a huge burden. That's that's a lot of emotional baggage to deal with, and that could screw a person up. And, and not to mention, you know, the fact that his dad's half-alien, a fact that I'm not even sure if Ursula knows about or not. And, you know, let's not forget about the fact that, you know, Monsters totally ambushed the Red Wings. He's the last one left, for crying out loud. So, you know, he's got all this dead people, you know, on his watch and things like that. And the poor guy. I mean, seriously. Yeah, see? Bigs and, there you go. I just mentioned them. Who just all totally died at the beginning of the game. Damn, 15 years old. Yeah, I know in the original he was 17, and honestly, to some extent, I can understand some of the misgivings toward him at 17, because that would be, you know, be a bit weird, but I mean, at, his character makes a lot, you know, without any other changes, his character makes more sense as a 15-year-old than as a 17-year-old. It, it does. Because now we can factor in the whole going through puberty thing in there, so, you know. Again, I'm getting way off track. Oh my god, I'm getting way off track with this stuff. I'm sorry, guys. Hooray! We learned a band I might never ever use because I don't know if Theodore is ever going to come in my party when... Well, except for that one part where you guys said I totally needed him, but Ursula is totally not needed in that party where I totally need him. Alright, so that's my practice file thingy. Alright, so they made us all healed up. Although, everyone gets four levels and everyone else gets one. Actually, while I'm here... Um... Okay, so I guess I didn't officially use one of my tents or anything like that, because the moon phase didn't change. But I think someone mentioned something about that, too. Uh, well, like, 
their levels are all over the place, so I can't tell for sure. Well, no, they, they've gained the same amount of experience. So, actually, there, there is some way I can check. I can totally check somewhat. Alright, so Fluttershy does l level slower than Palom does, but I don't know in comparison to everybody else. So, but I mean, that's just going by that. Oh well. Alright, so, and I'm guessing... Okay, so... So I'm guessing these are like warp points throughout the dungeon. That's cool! Ah, oh, game! Because now, my, the problem I just mentioned at the start where, well, when I started this place, that, oh, crap, I have to go through five floors of the shit before I can actually get something and get somewhere and save the game, and I guess I don't have to worry about that anymore. So that is, now, now since I got into battle, I gotta save the game again. Alright, fine. Have it your way, game. Have it your way. I'm fine. I can totally deal with, wait, wait. Why am I on basement three? I have it in basement two. Oh, okay. Wait, was there a place on basement one I missed? I thought there was like a past, or did I already go, th or is that the first one I went through? Might've been the first one I went through, the one that goes around the top? That might've been the first one I did. Well, that's the one that leads to the teleporter, so maybe I went, Yeah, I think I already went through that one. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm just kind of thinking here. I mean, it is 8.20 in the morning, and I recorded this five minutes after I got home from work. I'm sitting here in my underwear for crying out loud. So, um, thank you for watching, everybody, and, uh, what can I say about the rest of this? I mean, I still have no idea what the hell is going on, so you're just gonna have to suffer through my crazy antics and either be completely turned off or very entertained by it. So, thank you once again, everybody, and I shall see you next time.